I'm really very interested in addressing a, a dangerous misconception. A lot of people think that there is a centrifugal, that's how that word's pronounced, a force that is forcing things out of circles and things don't want to move in circles because of this force that exists to make them bust out of the circle. And really what's happening is, well, <clears throat> you can watch another video on that, but this is just a quick demonstration video to prove to you that things don't have a force pushing them out of a circle. As the ball rolls around and I release Does. I'm going to do that a few more times until you completely believe me. See which way it went? All right, what about this guy here? How about this? Whoa, not that fast. See which way it goes? Study carefully which way the ball goes, and you will learn about why the ball is doing that. And the ball, I think, just wants to go. what? It wants to go in a straight what? It wants to go in a straight what? Why does it want to do that? Why does everything want to do what it has been doing? This is Newton's first law. So this is a filthy lie and things simply want to go in a straight line because they have inertia. So if somebody ever tells you there's a centrifugal force and that's why your arms want to fling out when you're spinning around and buckets of water that you fling over your head stay um, full of water. It's not true. That happens because of inertia. And inertia is not a force. It is a fundamental tendency of all things. Goodbye.